Origin 2023b adds a new data connector feature called Duplicate Sheet with More Files. This feature allows additional data to be imported into the workbook using the same post import script. This allows you to customize one set of data to your specifications and then allows you to quickly apply them to all subsequent data sets. In this example, I have some weather data from Logan Airport that I would like to plot and analyze. The problem is that the X data is in the date time format, but I need just the time portion. I want to import the data and create a new column that just has the time information. Let's import our data using the CSV data connector. Activate an empty workbook and select data, connect to file, text slash CSV. The data used in this example can be found in batch three of the samples folder. We are going to start with one file, Logan Airport Weather 2022 January 1st. We are going to keep the default settings. What we want to change is the post import script. The button to the left of the OK opens the other options dialog. And it is here we can enter our lab talk script that executes after the data is imported. We will paste our script here. The script takes the date information from the file name and creates a new user parameter row called file date and then adds the date information to that row. Then, the date string is converted into a date and is subtracted from column A, the date time column, and the results are added to column 5. Column 5 is named time and then set to the time format with hour and minute display. Click OK for both dialogs to initiate the import. If we need to make further changes to the script, we can click the green data connector icon and select post import script. For example, we can go back and add this line to the script to change the column designation from Y to X. Now that we have customized our first data sheet, we can import the data from other dates into the same workbook using the same lab talk script. This process will batch import our additional files with the data connector post import script. Click the data connector icon and select duplicate sheet with more files. We can either import all the files in a specified folder or individually select the files we want to import. For this example, we will manually add the other three CSVs in batch three. We can see that our other datasets are successfully imported with the same settings we used for the initial dataset. Thanks for watching.